we're surrounded by people and we don't feel safe at all and other times we're completely alone but we also don't feel safe Maybe 
sometimes you can't find that in the real world and I'm sorry if that's the case I hope that your situation can change you definitely deserve to feel loved and safe surrounded by those that you love and those who love you you are incredible and you definitely deserve all of that even when you don't think so I know that you are probably thinking about that that you, did, you don't really deserve any of that well you do you do most of the times you're just being too hard on yourself it's just how life goes we tend to be a little extra mean to ourselves and then it turns out we are kind of just making our lives harder than they have to be but I just wanted you to know that you don't have to pretend to be okay when you're with me here okay you you might feel like you don't deserve anything but you do all of your feelings are valid and you deserve to be loved and understood you deserve to have kind people surrounding you and you deserve to feel safe you are safe here with me, okay? I'll tell you as many times as you need to. And I also wanted to tell you that you are loved. Despite everything that your brain might tell you, you are so, so loved. I know you've been working hard. And I know you're probably so tired of it all but just hang in there okay you got this you got this it's gonna be okay all your efforts will be rewarded and I know that sometimes it feels like things are just not going your way but maybe the good things are still coming for you you just need to be a little bit more patient just a tiny bit okay will you do that for me well you won't do that for me you will do that for yourself okay just be patient with yourself and good things will come I know that it's easier said than done because sometimes we we keep waiting and waiting and it's like it never happens but lately I've been trying to be more patient and trying to look at all the good things that I have in my life instead of focusing on the bad ones and it's definitely helpful not saying that we should ignore the bad things but they are there we just need to deal with them a little bit better and it 
it's okay if you don't know how to do that right now. You're trying your best, and that's enough. You're doing really great. You're incredible. I mean, look at how far you've come. I know that a lot of people are thinking the exact same as you are. They feel like they are behind, and they feel like they're not doing good enough. At the end of the day, I think most of us are thinking the same way. But look at us. We're all comparing ourselves to each other. And like, it's like I want what you have and you want what I have. And it's like a vicious cycle. It keeps going because we're always comparing each other. And why? You know, like, why are we always running and running and looking for something that other people have instead of being content with what we achieved so far? Like, there's so many things that I'm sure you can be proud of, but yet we are still not happy and still not content with anything. I feel like sometimes we fail a little bit when it comes to praising ourselves. Like, you've done so much. You deserve all the praise. You deserve to feel like you're incredible. And I know you don't most of the times, but you should. And I hope you start seeing that, honestly. Because you deserve to know how amazing you are. Well, I hope you're feeling a little bit relaxed, at least. Let some of that pressure off. Your body has been through enough. It needs some rest. I hope you can get some proper sleep tonight. It's gonna be okay. It's a great day for you. You deserve it. You are amazing. I want you to get some rest today, okay? Sometimes we just need to hear it. We need to hear that we are loved, that we're not alone. We got this. It's, I think, one of the worst feelings. It's like loneliness. Because you, no matter if you have people, for 
you to reach out to, you always feel that sense of like being alone. And I think that's one of the worst feelings to have, is when you think that there's no one else, it's just you, even in a room full of people. And I think that's so difficult to fight, that feeling, like that emptiness, which is why I'm here trying to help you with that today because I know how it feels being in that same position and feeling that so I guess that I just would like to somehow let you know that you are not alone with that feeling and obviously I know that I am on your screen right now, <laughs> but as I'm filming this, I feel so much empathy for you and so much love. I just wish you could feel that <laughs> in a more real way. Um, and. I guess that's the point, you know, I'm just the person on a screen, but I don't want to be seen as just the person on the screen. I want to pass this message to you. So, you know, it's not about me, it's about the message that I want to pass on to you, which is that you are not alone and you are loved. I know that there are people around you that care about you. And I just wish that I could somehow help you understand that and feel and believe that. I don't know if any of it's making sense right now. But, um, I guess I, I just have been feeling like this lately, and when I say this, I mean this loneliness and feeling like no one cares, no one loves me, and I know it isn't true, it's just my brain that is going through it right now, but I guess that made me want to film this video in case you're feeling the same because since I'm so close to this feeling, I feel like I can better help you fighting it. <laughs> it is really weird though, because even though I also struggle, one thing that always helps me get through it is knowing that I can maybe help you um, feel less alone in this fight that helps me get through my own stuff, which is really good um, that I get to do that with my videos, and I, I'm really grateful for that, and I'm grateful for you for allowing me to do this and for allowing me to be a part of your life. It is such an important thing, and I don't think you will ever understand how grateful I am for that. So, thank you, and thank you for existing, for being you, for being here. I know I always say it, but I truly mean it. I, I just really think that I wouldn't be here if it weren't for you, so... I appreciate you. I hope you feel loved, because you are. I'm gonna let you rest. I hope you can have a really, really good night. And maybe you feel a little bit more light and relieved. I don't know. I always 
always feel better knowing that I'm not the only one thinking a certain way or feeling a certain way. So maybe you'll feel the same by knowing that I understand what you're going through, or at least that I care about what you're going through and about you. That's, yeah, that's what I wanted to tell you today. Just that I love you and you're so, so special. You're so freaking awesome. I just wish you could see that more often. I hope you have the best night. Just try to relax a little. Try to let go and get some rest. I hope tomorrow is a great day for you. If it's not, then that's okay too, alright? Just don't put too much pressure on yourself. You got this. It'll be okay. I will see you soon. <laughs>